we are going to try on the kimono that we got. Yay! Yeah, we did it! Yes. <laughs> so this is the first time that you will actually be wearing the full shebang. Hello! <laughs> You got that with you? Oh, I have it over here. <laughs> you have it. Yeah. So sorry about that. Thank so you. you have your own. I also have my own. Cool. Okay. So we're gonna go through each piece and just introduce uh, what the pieces are, what they do, why you need them. So just pull out anything that you're curious about, and I will right. tell you about it. I'm just gonna stick my hand in. And then, oh, 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 that's a big thing. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is one of my favorites. What is? So we got this guy. Okay. Uh, ooh, he's got like... So, this one's mine. <laughs> ooh. Okay. Yeah, I've got a little fancy one with little peacocks on it. Nice. Okay, so this is called the Obi Makura. Okay, Obi Makura. Uh, do you know what Makura is? I don't want to put... Ah, go for it. This pillow! <laughs> it means pillow. So it's the Obi pillow. So basically what this thing does... <laughs> I'm actually have to grab an Obi really quick. Okay. To show you. So this is the Obi. So when you fold this kind of obi, this basically becomes like a square on your back, like that. But in order to give it like a more, like a fuller shape, we use this guy. So this one actually goes underneath and it kind of, and it rests on your back. So it kind of gives it a more like full shape when you're done tying. It doesn't just go in there just like that. We actually have... Um, a piece that goes over it. This is not in your kit because this is one of the things that you actually do see. Okay. Everything that's in your kit is stuff that goes underneath. Okay. But this is called the obi age. Ageru is the word for to lift or to raise. So what we do with this is the obi age goes over the obi makura. It's like a magic trick. <laughs> Where'd it go? You can't see it. It's gone. And then that'll go underneath the obi. And then tie the obimakura and the obiage so this this part becomes the front oh. but it also helps keep your obi up so if you actually if you put this on and then you untie it after you put everything on your obi will just fall apart yeah so i always wondered about that yeah so <laughs> okay it helps and it's fashionable so that's the obi makura, the obi pillow. Cool. Okay. So next, I'm gonna put this guy over here. Ah, uh, next thing. Ooh. Okay, I feel metal. What's next? Oh, I got clips. clips. We got little clips. So oh, these really? are really useful for all sorts of things. So one of the things that I use these for is mm -hmm. to keep this piece in shape. Okay. This is. <laughs> I realize I've got ahead of myself. It's okay it's uh, because yes. you could. You also have one. I think it's oh, no. it over here. There's I got it. it, I got it. Oh! <laughs> it's like, I see a lot of Okay, okay. I went ahead and did that for you. Thank you. So, <laughs> this is the Eddy Sheen. So, Eddy basically means color. Okay. Okay. The Sheen is kind of like, it's like a stabilizer, so it keeps the shape of your collar nice and mm. uh, just in a nice shape. Okay. So, it's just one of those things that, like, it helps you just look more fashionable in the end. Like okay. your your collar's not all wrinkly and lopsided. Like. Okay. So it's like the thing with like when you go to the store and they're like button up shirts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So if you want, so you keep it. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. <laughs> I see. Gotcha. Yeah. So I guess a like a Western equivalent would mm. be like like if you wear a necktie and you want to keep it in order, you use a tie pin, mm -hmm. right? Okay. It's something like that sort of, I guess. Anyway, that's the Eddie Sheen. Cool. Okay. And so the clips themselves. They're just called clip, clip, clip. Just clip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kimono clip. Nice. <laughs> so 
um, some people might use like laundry clips that you use mm. like to hang your laundry, but those can, because they're just plastic, mm -hmm. the teeth can actually harm mm. your kimono, and especially if you have something that's nice, it's made of silk, you These don't want to hurt it. These are really soft. They're very soft. They they're have rubbery. like a little bit, like a rubber mouth in there. So these are specifically for kimono. Okay. Just so that you don't damage your nice precious fabrics. Important. <laughs> yep. What's next? Ooh. Ooh. Is this one piece? Yes. Okay. Ooh. This is another obi bit. This is called the obi ita. Do you know what ita means? Like itai? No. Okay. <laughs> ita, that means <laughs> ouch. Yeah, I was like... This won't hurt you. Okay, I was like, I don't want to Okay, hey, this it. one's mine. So the obi ita, ita basically means board. So like oh. if you think of like chopping board, it's mana ita. Okay. So obi okay. ita. So it's the obi board, basically. Obi board. That makes more sense. This one goes around your waist. So you want the you want the curved part to be on top? Okay. <laughs> Ooh! Yeah, so... <laughs> I'm like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is this is great because it'll this. it'll keep everything nice and smooth on the front when you wear your obi. This is nice. Yeah, yeah. It's really nice. And then like all the things that you tie around, mm. you tuck behind it. Oh. So you don't have weird lumps where you've tied uh, ribbons and knots and things. There's so many mysteries being solved. Yeah. <laughs> you have so like, many questions. So many things that I'm always like. But structurally, how? But okay. Yeah. Cool. So that's the obi kita. Okay. The next one. So I know that you pulled one of these for mm -hmm. the video. Oh, yes. like I did try stuff on um, at the recycle shop or yeah. the thrift store. These are called, and this is one way you can fold them. You can okay. keep them like this. You can keep them like yeah. this. You can keep them just knotted up okay. randomly. Um, these are called koshi himo. So koshi, koshi is an interesting word because we don't really have a word for it in English. But it's basically the area like from your natural waist down to your hip. It's like this mm. whole space right here. Okay. So this is your koshi. Okay. Okay. It's like your lower back plus the uh, like your torso. It's like your lower torso basically. And so, and then himo means string. So it's your torso string. It's basically just <laughs> I know it sounds weird when I literal like, translation. Yeah, but it, it's basically yes. just a tie. They're just ties. Okay. They're just cotton ties. Okay. Um, to, Rat when you wear your your under kimono when you put on your kimono every time you wanna fasten it in place you use these. Okay, so it doesn't really matter. I didn't know if these were different lengths, but they're all typically the same. Because there are some that are longer, okay. there are some that are shorter. It just depends on what you prefer. But they're all the like, koshi kimono. Koshi kimono. Koshi okay. Yeah, these are all the same. Okay. They also have like patterned ones like these, and you can actually make these too. If you have like leftover scraps of fabric, you can just make these. I like to use these too um, to tie my sleeves back oh. when I'm doing stuff, so okay. I don't, you know, get them dirty or in the way or anything. So these can go over your kimono as well. Just in that in that okay. situation. In that situation. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. But typically, it's but all typically all they're layers. hidden under all the layers. Cool. All right, what else you got? Please. Um, <laughs> I keep like this has such a fun. Like, okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Bongos. Aha. <laughs> <laughs> They call this a magic belt. Magic belt. Magic belt. Because mm. it's got <laughs> magic tape, which oh. is what they call Velcro. Yeah. I learned. I learned something I can use in everyday life. Yay! Because the search for Velcro has oh. been a long one. It's magic tape. Gotcha. Magic tape. Gotcha. Yeah. So this one. Um, I'm so happy. <laughs> Place of another piece that's in here. Okay, should I grab it? Yeah, go for it. It's the Which one? the wide pink one. This is called datejime. So this one's mine. They come in all sorts of colors. Yours actually Ooh. has elastic in yes. it, yes. which is helpful and is actually really really comfy. Yes. I've been thinking of getting one that has elastic in it. But in oh, women's kimono, you actually oh, fold it over, gotcha. and then so to keep. Uh, to keep that fold like nice and neat mm. and to keep everything in place after you've tied it you will use this one it's like a wider belt so it's got more surface area mm -hmm. so it'll keep more of the fabric down it'll keep it from uh, having wrinkles and stuff and so yeah so that's date jime jime just basically means to tie <clears throat> date is still kind of a mystery so I, I'm not going to explain that today that's an interesting Logical, thing, but yeah. So the magic belt is basically <laughs> magic, magic belt. <laughs> so it's, it's basically that they made just with belt. I just really like that belt. 
Really I'll meditate. That makes me happy. Well, we used to have magic true. markers. I just like it because it is magic. I also think <laughs> Velcro is technically a brand name. We're supposed to call Something them like hook that. and loop fasteners. That's too long. I know. That is no one. Whatever Velcro. Velcro is Velcro. Alright, this is magic tape now. Magic tape. Magic tape. <gasps> Do you have any more pieces? <laughs> I, I have a cup. Oh, okay. I think it's just one. Uh, looks like just one, I think. Oh, yes. Okay. This one's okay. called the Corrine Belt. Corrine Belt. Corrine. I don't know why I said it with a weird American R at first. Corrine Belt. Corrine Belt. This here is the Corrine, Corrine Belt. Corrine Belt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you'll clip so, this on the underside. Mm -hmm. The one side that goes under. Mm -hmm. So your left side is always going to go over. What does the right side over mean? If you switch them, that is how they dress people for funerals. I made that mistake, don't do it! Thankfully it was at a hotel. And it's okay, like, <laughs> you know, as non-Japanese we kind of get a little bit of a pass for ignorance. But, don't do but it. But, <laughs> try not to be a corpse. <laughs> Cause people will be, uh, uh, Cause some people will be way too polite to point it out to yes. you. So just don't walk through life like that. Um, so left side, left side. Left side is always over. Okay. Left side. So you'll use the accordion belt to clip your right side, mm -hmm. and then you'll move the belt through your armhole so it comes outside, around your back, and then this side clips onto the left side, so it'll pull them together. I think we went through all of your pieces. Oh, I had this guy. Oh, but, um... this guy I actually don't have, and oh. on your kit it was listed as a kimono belt. Okay. So okay. what I'm guessing is that that is a stand-in for kochihimo. So I'm guessing that that's just if you. This is like. All right, I, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go now. Just put it on and go. <laughs> okay. Seat belts. Yeah. So, many seat so I guess it's just like because this was kind of a beginner's kit. Like um, it's, they're trying to make it as easy as possible for you. Thank you so much for. Like, yeah. 